Hey guys, what's up? Today I'll be giving you five tips on wedding photography. Earlier this week I shot my first wedding, so I thought I'd give you some tips and tricks to make your first shoot a bit easier. Tip number one guys, use Lightroom presets to edit your wedding photos. Now, using Lightroom presets on your wedding photos will help the photos blend into each other more and it will create a consistent style and theme throughout the day. Now this helps the vibe of the day stay more consistent and it will also speed up your editing process. Tip number two guys, include more candid photography. Now depending on what type of photos the bride and groom want you to take, I'd still highly recommend taking as many natural, candid shots as possible. This will give your photos a more realistic portrayal of the um, day's events and the people who actually attended the wedding will be more grateful for those type of photos. Tip number three guys, relax and try and enjoy the day. Now being able to relax and enjoy the moment will um, help you a lot on the day because you need to be very focused and you want to be able to use your creative ability um, to your potential. So if you're a bit on edge, then I'd highly recommend trying to relax and just making sure you've got yourself the right headspace for, this, for the day. Oh, tip four guys, bring spares and extra batteries. Uh, bring in spare batteries and extra cameras is really important because but you never know what's going to happen at a wedding shoot. Uh, you never know if they're going to ask you to stay a few extra hours long or someone could even kick over your camera by accident. So having that backup lens or camera body is just, you know, something you really want to show the table if you want to create a professional level for your company. Right guys, finally tip five, don't be afraid to get the close-up shots. Now, missing out on shots at a wedding is could be one of the worst things ever, and especially if the only reason is because you didn't want to get in the way. Um, most bride and grooms, they want you to get the best pictures possible, so obviously that expects a little bit of moving around. So don't, don't be stuck to the floor, guys. Move around a bit. Make sure you're in the right place at the right time. Now guys, obviously every wedding is going to be slightly different, so always ask the bride and groom where you can uh, move around and sort of what things you're allowed to do before the event. An example of this is um, the wedding I shot last week, uh, sort of too far away when the bride and groom were sharing their first kiss and unfortunately I didn't get the best shot, or at least not the shot I wanted to. but. Hopefully in the future I'll be able to make up for my mistakes. Okay, so that wraps up the video guys. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to give it a like and subscribe if you enjoyed the video. And let me know what you want me to do next in the comments.